When I was younger, I always wanted to look old enough to sneak into bars. I mean, haven't most of us tried doing that? I was in a hurry to age. But today, after a couple of years when I look into the mirror, I realize I've stopped looking my age. My friends look way younger. I never step out in the sun without sunscreen or stay up at night, but I still have visible spots and fine lines. After discussing it with a friend who's in healthcare, I learned that my crappy diet stopped me from looking my best. In today's video, let's discuss foods that age your skin faster. Can soup be dangerous? Is meat altering your skin game? We're talking about all that and more. Do you rely on a cup of coffee to get your day started? Coffee tastes divine with sugar and creamers. Depending on how much you add, it may impact your skin. Regularly consuming too much sugar can hasten the aging process of the skin. When you overeat sugar, it can create ages or advanced glycation end products, which harm the collagen in your skin. This can make you lose suppleness. Now, are you thinking of adding sweeteners to your coffee? At first, switching may seem healthy, but it may have skin-damaging consequences. Artificial sweeteners are nutritionally devoid and damage intestinal health and insulin levels. This can affect critical bodily processes and make you crave more sweets throughout the day. If you want to enjoy the actual benefits of coffee, have it black. Remember to have it in moderation because of the diuretic effects of caffeine, which can excrete more water from your system. Water loss leads to wrinkles, fine lines, dullness, and dryness. Dehydration also accelerates the aging process, making you appear older than you are. Another super dehydrating drink to avoid is alcohol. Was that a buzzkill? Those wild nights harm your complexion and give you a horrible hangover. You can look at the skin of rock stars from the 70s and 80s. The alcohol overuse made their skin look so old and wrinkly. Alcohol can be beneficial for heart health when consumed in moderation. Drinking a couple of glasses of wine occasionally won't affect you or your skin, but consuming sugary beverages will produce free radicals. Drinking alcohol depletes the body of vitamin A, an antioxidant necessary for cell renewal and turnover. Collagenase is a natural enzyme that is created when you consume alcohol. It cleans up our damaged collagen and promotes the formation of new collagen. Reckless drinking, on the other hand, speeds up the process that causes healthy collagen loss leaving your skin devoid of collagen and no scope for collagen reformation. Because of this, people who drink excessively appear older than they actually are. Alcohol also makes blood vessels enlarge. The malar rash on the skin causes redness in the nasal folds and cheeks due to expanding blood vessels. This can result in broken capillaries in the face. Regular drinking causes red facial lines to become permanent webs. And lastly, the dehydration side effects You'll soon start seeing dark circles resulting from the fat deposits under your eyes sinking in due to dehydration and loss of firmness. This thin skin area also becomes more translucent, revealing the nearby blood vessels. If you have to consume alcohol, choose non-sugary beverages like wine, champagne, or vodka. Additionally, limit your drinks. Follow each alcoholic beverage with a glass of water to maintain hydration. Bacon for breakfast and hot dogs for lunch can sound great until you hear this. Processed meats are often doused with preservatives. Usually jerky, bacon, sausages, organ meats, and meat spreads undergo curing. This is when harmful preservatives get added. A common preservative in processed foods, particularly meat, is sodium nitrate. This preservative can harm collagen and elastin causing them to degrade more quickly than is typical throughout the aging process. Skin cells are kept in shape by collagen and elastin. They keep your skin firm and young, but once they get destroyed, you'll start seeing wrinkles. Common table salt is also used for preserving a few meat cuts. Salt isn't good for the skin either. Water retention from salt results in puffiness and swelling. The sodium content in restaurants is often high to bring out the flavor in non-vegetarian dishes. So avoid them, along with ultra-processed meat too. Avoiding processed meat also means giving up your favorite pepperoni pizza. I know, Friday nights won't be the same without digging into the delicious slice. But in a way, you'll avoid acne and itching. Here's how. Gluten is another problem with processed meats. Most grains include protein called gluten, 
but you can also find it in unexpected foods like sausage casings, pepperoni on pizza, and even cold cuts from the deli. Numerous studies have shown the adverse effects of the substance on the body, particularly the skin. Your digestive system cannot metabolize the protein if you have gluten sensitivity or an allergy. The protein zonulin produced in the gut maintains the gut lining's integrity. The overproduction of zonulin can wreak havoc in the gut, and needless to say, the entire reaction is sparked by gluten. This inflammatory reaction starts in the digestive system and slowly involves your skin. While it might not seem important in skincare, keep in mind that inflammatory skin diseases like eczema and acne can add years to your actual age. We still rely on frozen dinners despite knowing the advantages of freshly cooked food. It can be out of convenience, but you may end up consuming a ton of synthetic preservatives and additives. Ready-to-eat meals and canned soup bombard your body with salt and sugar in just a single serving. Furthermore, none of the ingredients are skin-friendly. The entire global population is leaning towards packaged foods. To find out what would happen if we didn't eat them regularly, scientists scrutinized the people of Papua New Guinea. The community there consumes foods that have undergone very little processing and have minimal salt and sugar. Scientists did not find any cases of acne. Simply put, our love of junk food prevents us from looking vibrant and young. Moving along, chuck the energy drinks. Although Red Bull can get you through the day, these energy drinks are not good for your skin. Energy drinks include a lot of sugar and acid. Most dentists recommend avoiding it as they make your teeth brittle and more vulnerable to stains. A tainted set of teeth will make your smile look older. Energy drinks may cause dehydration due to their caffeine content. This makes your skin look less healthy. Conventional energy drinks are made more palatable by heaps of sugar. Sugar is an inflammation-promoting substance. A study indicated that caffeine delays wound healing, which means that if you regularly use energy drinks, you might have to deal with the symptoms of breakouts and injuries for longer. So see that you drink the recommended eight to 10 glasses of water daily, even more if you're exercising or having hard drinks. We know that trans fats are bad for us, but when hunger strikes, we still reach out for a bag of potato chips. The tasty flavors like salt and vinegar, ranch or barbecue make them even more tempting. Trans fats are abundant in fast food and can clog your arteries. It would be best if you avoided trans fats from fried foods like chicken nuggets, fries, and onion rings in most restaurants. They make our cells less fluid, strain the liver, and cause inflammation within the body, making your skin look older, stiffer, and more wrinkled. Consuming fatty acids causes the body to produce more interleukin-6. This chemical is an indicator of inflammation directly related to premature aging. Packaged fried foods with vegetable oils might also damage immune system function and harm cell respiration. To stay young, replace an unhealthy snack with air pop chips, or even better, eat veggie sticks like celery, carrots, and cucumbers with hummus dip. And coming to the last entry on this list, this might come as a shock to you, so brace yourself. We're talking about dairy. Usually people have dairy to increase their calcium levels. Vegetables like kale, spinach, arugula, and others can take care of that calcium deficit. Most people don't know that the dairy products on your supermarket shelves might be adulterated. Most cows are injected with hormones like progesterone, insulin, and growth factors to make more milk. Hormone and chemical-laden dairy consumption can have terrible skin impacts. These hormones can lead to increased inflammation, skin breakdown, and aging. The hormones from the milk promote your skin to produce more sebum or oil. In a study, a marked increase in serum insulin and IGF-1 levels comparable to those of high glycemic foods was found in participants after having dairy. This means that your skin would react just like it would after eating candy or cake loaded with sugar. If you believe dairy harms your skin's appearance, try an elimination diet for a few weeks. Eliminate all dairy products from your diet, including coffee creamers, cheese sauces, and powdered cheese in packaged items like macaroni and cheese. You'll be able to judge if the non-dairy approach is perfect for you in a few days. When you need dairy, choose organic cheese, yogurt produced from the milk of non-hormonal injection-fed and pasture-fed cows. Ditch your traditional makeup routine if you want flawless glowing skin. You can get a better, longer-lasting natural glow with fresh fruits and vegetables. Wondering what to pick? Check out these 12 foods that'll make your skin glow, or 13 foods to avoid if you want younger-looking skin. 
Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both and learn how to avoid triggers for skin aging. What unhealthy foods have you cut from your diet to look younger? Let us know in the comments below.